Hi, welcome to Software Basics. In today's tutorial, I'm going to be showing you how to get a direct access link to your Google Drive files. So in this example, what I'm going to be using is this file in my Google Drive. Once you've located yours, just simply right click and then click on get shareable link. It should automatically copy that. Now, normally if we paste this link on the URL, it comes up like this and this isn't exactly a good way for displaying it it is for a user interface if you want to download it and then print it now what I mean by a direct link we want a link that is basically the main location of where this image is stored this isn't where the image is stored within Google server so we want to get that direct link and to do that is very simple all you just have to do is paste the original link that you copied then replace where it says open with UC and then just simply press enter. Now you can see this is completely different. The link is completely different up here and this is a direct link to where this file is stored on Google Drive. Now a perfect reason for why you may need that is when you're writing HTML code. So I'll give you a quick demonstration of that. So assuming we have the HTML code so I'll just quickly whip up something here. So I'll just quickly give it a title, Google Drive. And then we'll go into the body and we want to basically show an image. So if we paste this original source link and we left it as open. Now, if we try to view this, so I'm just going to live view this. You can see nothing comes up because when you have open within the link, this is not a direct link to that particular file. So what we're gonna do now is just simply change this to UC. And now if we go back and have a look at the live view, you can see it automatically changes and now the image is displayed as well. So this is really good because it means you don't have to store your files within your uh, local server. You can just store it externally and use Google Drive. So again, if we undo that, you can see it disappears. And if we redo it, you can see it reappears. So that is pretty much how you get a direct link to your Google Drive files. Anyway, if you enjoyed this video, make sure to leave a like. And of course, subscribe to my channel for more videos like this. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next one.